I really like where I work. I just feel tremendously lucky to be working here. I'm really passionate about helping people. I just really love the fact that I could work with students. It's very rewarding because you shape human minds. I really love what I do because I have a hand in changing people's lives every day. The university itself is wonderful. This is the best university in the nation. I just love working here. Um, I have to say a big part of it has been the people that I've worked with. Um, they're, you know, a diverse group of people, uh, very interesting. Uh, I like, enjoy working in an educational setting. Instead of a customer-oriented focus, it's a student-oriented focus, which I've never been a part of before. It's different. It's different in a good way. I really like where I work. I like the people I work with. I like the people I work for. The people uh, at National University uh, really make all the difference in my work each and every day. From students to staff to faculty to administration is the human element that I love about this place. We feel like a family here. I know that's, that term's tossed around quite a bit, but I really feel that's true. And it's really unique that you, know, you could have a job, you could be in the same organization for as long as I have. Uh, and be able to move through the ranks, so to speak. There hasn't been a day yet where I've said, I don't want to go to work. I actually get up just fine, enjoy what I do, and it's never gone un unrewarded. I'm told constantly, we appreciate what you're doing, you're doing a great job, we appreciate you. The university has always been great to its employees. I think that's another piece. They've always taken care of us. We have great benefits. The university's been very good to me, and uh, I hope that in return I have uh, done a great job for the university. The students and the faculty are absolutely phenomenal. We have a very, very qualified faculty and people that are, are very um, dedicated to what they do. I'm passionate about it helping people. I know that sounds corny and it's kind of like the thing that you're supposed to say, but not only with the students, but also with the staff. It's, it's really great to work for an organization where you can hire people as a center assistant and the next thing you know, they're associate regional dean. It's, it's a noble place to be. It's, it's bettering the world. And people come to us to better their lives and to move on and helping them find a way to make those dreams come true certainly makes this a different sort of job than, than, any, than many other fields. I love what I do. Um, I mean, I've been here 24 years, and it seems like 24 months. It's, it's fresh, it's exciting. Um, we have great leadership, which is awesome. The leadership is fantastic. I usually talk about the four uh, aspects of good leadership, and they, we do find them here. The leadership has the vision, values, charisma, and a powerful character of integrity. So that is great. What really resonates for me is the forward-thinking vision that the institution has and its commitment to excellence. And the way those two are married together, I think, makes us unstoppable. To go from just that the one institution, National University, to all the different affiliate groups, and uh, you know our endowment growing, going from basically um, you know, an institution in financial difficulty to, you know, one of the largest endowments in the country is amazing to me to watch that growth and the vision and being a part of that. It's a strong institution. I think the, the future is very bright. It's a very well organized institution. I think they have their goals very clearly defined. I see how other higher education institutions work or even companies and sort of the turmoil they have and their inability to communicate effectively. And then when I come back and I see how well we work together here as a unit, I am proud of that. In traditional institutions, there's a lot of layers and it's very difficult to make changes. At NU, if you have an idea on how to change the program to make it more effective for students or how to improve the quality of the program, NU will let you do that. They're always on the cutting edge, and it's always exciting to see what National University is going to do next. I know that National has been around for decades, but at the same time, there's a real shift with what people um, look at when trying to, to, to find out what they want to do with their education. As education gets more global, the institutions that do things the right way and, and are about the right things, that it's really important for us to make a case, not just that we're out there, but that the way we do things 
is different and that it really matters. I'm proud of the fact that they're a nonprofit institution and um, you know most revenue goes right back into our facilities and our technology so that our students are able to to reap the benefits of a really high quality education. When working for a nonprofit organization, especially within higher learning, you actually feel like um, when you're dealing with students, you know, aka a customer, you actually feel like you're having a big impact on their lives. And it really gets people to focus on, you know, the main point of why we're here, which is actually, you know, for the students, helping them to accomplish and, you know, move further along down in their lives. Given the amount of competition from for-profit institutions that we now face, having a culture that is student-focused and service-focused will allow us to be competitive with what I think is an increasingly intense competition. The only way we can compete in the long run is through quality. There is a sense of, of the institution being there for the students. And if you look at, for instance, our sort of active advocacy for military students, if you look at the way we um, sort of have designed the core structure around the lives of our students, I think in, in, in a lot of ways what some institutions say, it, you know, we're about our students, we really embrace that, that we really look to make sure our students have a quality experience coming through our programs. The atmosphere here is uh, one that uh, stresses student success. So we're here to make sure that the students have a positive experience, but also that they learn to the best of their ability. The students, most of all, is what I'm really proud of. When I was a, a teacher, I had a student tell me, the class was moving along too slowly, so could you speed it up? I'm paying 45 cents a minute to be in this class. <laughs> the students are very motivated. I think our students inspire us. They help us keep our compass pointed at True North. <laughs> I see before me a hundred stories and each one of them is compelling. Each one of them will uh, make anybody that works here probably smile and feel good about what they do. We've uh, got some great stories about students from Afghanistan and Iraq completing their degrees um, on time, you know, when they, when they said they were going to. Um, because we were able to offer online programs. So um, those, are, those are the types of things that make me very proud of how we conduct our work. It's a, it's a great reward to have in addition to a paycheck and the benefits and, and all the other trappings here. Many times students will come in and they're not really sure what their next step is in their life, but they know they're ready to make some step in the right direction in terms of advancing their careers or advancing their education experience and they know that fitting it into their regular life is going to be a challenge. To ultimately not have to make students choose between do I go to school or do I quit my job? What do I do with that? And I feel like institutions like National, it, it doesn't make you choose any longer. You really have the ability to do both, to be able to spend time with your family, to reach your academic goals, to be able to pay your mortgage, you know, all of those things, it's so obtainable. The importance and the emphasis on affordability, our format, not only is it accelerated pace, but it's very competitive and we aim to really reach a, a diverse group of, of students. We run a variety of classes on a one-month format, so every month it's something different. Uh, quite uh, frankly, I think our st students are uh, superior uh, to most other universities uh, because of their adaptability and flexibility to that accelerated format. It takes a special kind of student uh, to uh, you know, hit the books uh, almost every night. The thing that I really like about National is, um, one, the opportunity that I have to pursue my education while I'm working full time, and then also just the networking that's available across the system um, to further my growth career-wise as well. Students can take away what they really put into it and they can go on to teaching and be able to tell people, hey, go to National University. Working as a credential program spe specialist, I work with teachers all day, every day. I work with people that want to teach 
second graders, teacher, teachers that want to teach high schoolers. Teachers are great people and I just found my niche with them and I get to work with people like that all day every day. I have the opportunity to uh, supervise both our student teachers and some of our interns to um, see my students um, in classrooms performing with the greatest skills um, as teachers. I marvel at what they're able to do in a classroom. On my end in credentials, we've actually recommended more credentials in the state of California than any other school. So that makes me proud in my position because you know we're, we know that we're doing our job. People want to keep coming back to our school because we have such a great name. I worked at uh, two research universities and a state university in California and I have never work with a group of faculty that is so concerned about their students and the success of their students, not only in their classes, but their academic success in, uh, in the real world of, of work, as I have here at National. You see that through, all throughout the ranks. That, that comes first, and that makes me proud that we always put the student first, or aim to, in every way we can. We move beyond uh, teaching the learning objectives and delivering the learning objectives and the program objectives uh, to really being able to provide the student with uh, learning that, that matters, relevant education that they can use immediately the next day from the classroom to the boardroom. So that when they turn around and go to work the next day or they go to that next level in their positions at their jobs, that um, the experience that they've had at National serves them very well. Everything's coming at you much faster than a conventional university. You know, it, and we're just preparing the students that much more for the, the reality of, of business. I've seen so many people be successful before they're even finished, you know, moving out into the, the areas that they're studying for. Now, one of the students recently, for example, have uh, secured a PhD program with a full fellowship at uh, Duke University, one of the top institutions in the country and uh, he was selected one among probably about 700 people. I feel like National University is a university with integrity. They take care of their students and my job allows me to do that. So I feel good at the end of the day when I go home. Getting the thank yous and the couldn't have done it without you, the, um, you know, just knowing that I helped someone who really needed it. Is, is nice. We stay the course with the promises that we make to our students. That is really, for me, something to be really proud of because not that many schools are out there that they can say that and they can say it with consistency. As admissions advisors, we're the ones that set the schedules up. We're like their hand that they can hold. Um, they don't have to think about what class is next, what should I be thinking about, what should I be taking, because we do everything, we set everything up. Students come to us for different issues. Um, sometimes they'll have concerns, sometimes they'll have complaints, and other times they just need help. Regardless of what they come to us with, um, every time that we speak to a student, or every time that we have an interaction with a student, what it does, it provides us an opportunity to build trust. I can help people and let them know that they have resources, that, that they're not alone in their educational goals, that there's somebody there that can assist them. They are supported 100% throughout their program when it starts off with their advisor and then financial aid. We have you know great library, we have great testing services. Every day we try to help students. I see the university working and trying to help them and sometimes even trying to get them back into school. Following up with them as a whole in every aspect of National University. I'm trying to get them um, processed as quickly as possible, try to get their classes, trying to uh, make sure that they're meeting their, their grade point average. We're here to make the student, the student experience as positive as possible. Uh, we want everything to be a fluid process. We want things to be, work efficiently for students. So if a student's frustrated, um, we want to help them. We want them to, to know that it's okay to come to us. We'll talk them through whatever it is that they need to do and make sure that they get the help they need. The service that we provide to our students or, or the care that we provide to our students, I haven't seen that anywhere else. It's very different from a UC system and a community college. As soon as you step in the door at National, you have so many people trying to help you, you know, maneuver through the system and try to get your degree and be successful. When a prospect calls or walks through the door or sends an email, they receive personal attention and they have that personal attention all the way through commencement. I 
can't believe how emotional it is when you go to commencement and you see your students. I mean, they're sometimes older than I am. And seeing them graduate is just, it, it's, I can't imagine the, the pride being any greater. The pride in the families that, that see the, this, this family member that, that's, that's got it done and they did it. Uh, many times, maybe the first time in their family, you hear that quite often. Having their families cheer them on, knowing that they've all achieved such an outstanding accomplishment. It's a life-changing moment, and there's no question. It chokes me up <laughs> every year. I mean, I'm a, I'm a softie. I just can't, I can't stand it. I can't help it.